Hi, nice to see you. Hi, Ariana. It's nice to see you. This is such a fun movie. What did you like best about it when you read the script? Ooh, I loved the heartfelt moments with family, but also the comedy was probably one of my favorite features in the movie. Um, I love the dry humor that they added. I think it makes like the special touch, especially with talking little babies, having sarcastic humor. I think it just works perfectly. Um, and I also loved, I also loved the new characters such as Tina and Precious and the fun little school characters. Um, yeah, that's what I love most about it. I love that you get to sing this. You have such a beautiful voice and the song you sang was so beautiful. Was this your singing debut? Yes, actually. Um, thank you for saying that. That means so much because I was extremely nervous for what people would say because I'm not a singer whatsoever. Um, but thank you for that. It was my singing debut. I was very nervous, but I'm excited and I'm proud of myself. I did it. I overcame my fear. You did a great job. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you um, so much. Did you have to show that you could sing when you were up for the role? Yeah. So um, they added the singing bit in the audition, which I was terrified for. So I go into the room and I do my I do my scenes, just the normal talking. And then they're like, OK, it's time for the singing. Um, and I was really nervous, but it went great. And everyone made me feel so comfortable and they were so sweet about it. But yeah, you auditioned with the singing, which is good. So it prepared me. <laughs> <laughs> now, early in the film, Tabitha has to sing off key. And I know that's difficult when you can sing on key to sing off key. How hard was that for you? It was actually pretty funny and exciting to do because um, I literally just started randomly saying really bad notes and it was pretty funny everyone was laughing and I was trying not to laugh while doing it um but it was it was exciting it was very funny to do <laughs> in the film your dad reconnects with some of his old toys when he goes up to the attic you're almost 14 now right 14 later yeah. this month mm -hmm. um do you have any toys from when you were younger that are special to you um, yeah, actually, I mean, I was, I was cleaning out my room a couple days ago, and I was going through like all the stuffed animals that I had like shoved in a drawer. Um, and there was one special stuffed animal that I always forgot about. It's like this little black and white, like kitty that I always had. Um, and I was looking through like memories like years ago when I was like three or four. And I actually got that um, same stuffed animal for Christmas. So it has like that little connection, but I always forgot about it. And it was so cool that I got to like revisit that little guy. It was great. <laughs> You've done voice work before in Scoob. How different was it to do Tabitha's voice because she's quite a bit younger than you? Yeah. Um, so Velma and Tabitha have very different voices that I kind of had to like create on my own. Velma is very raspy and she kind of is like the lower range of my voice. And Tabitha is definitely the higher pitch side. So it was pretty difficult also to sing in the tab of the voice because it's one thing to sing in your normal voice that you're comfortable with, but when you're making up a whole different voice, it's definitely difficult. Um, but Tabitha is definitely a softer, higher pitched voice. So it was cool to actually create their own differences. You've been so busy since you played Daphne on in Stuck on the Middle, which was a great show, by the way. I enjoyed that very much. Thank you. Um, when do you get time off and what do you like to do in your spare time? Um, I love to hang out with my friends. I feel like after I get off a project, wherever I am traveling, um, I like to just come home and they kind of reset me and set me center again, um, which is really nice. I kind of decompose with them. Um, and I like to paint. I like to ride my bicycle around. I like going on walks. Um, I like baking. That's definitely like a therapeutic thing for me to do. Anything with like art and baking, I love to do. Um, yeah, I don't like not being busy, which is good, definitely for someone that is busy. Um, but also recently I got a golf cart as a little gift and I've been driving that around. And maybe kind of illegal because I am 13, but it's okay. It's fine. Don't tell anyone. It's okay. <laughs> that sounds like a lot of fun. <laughs> yeah. And finally, uh, what's next for you? Because it looks like you have a lot of projects on the go. 
Um, yes, thank you. Um, right now, I'm definitely taking the summer to relax because I'm starting freshman year pretty soon. So it's my first year of high school, so I want to get ready for that and focus on that because school is very important. Tabitha definitely lets you know that. Um, but who knows? Who knows what's next? The universe has something aligned for me. But right now, I'm taking a well-needed break, and I'm starting school, which is great. Good for you. What, what day does school start on? Actually, I'm pretty lucky. It starts very late. I'm September 7th. Oh, that's good. Like after Labor Day. Yeah. yeah. yeah so I have, yeah. A, I have a long summer, but... When everyone breaks for summer, I'm still in school. So it's kind of compromise, but yes. Also, something I've already filmed, which is coming up, coming out, is 65 and Borderlands. So that is something you should look out for as well. I will definitely do that. Thank <laughs> you so much for chatting with me today. Thank and you. happy early birthday. Thank you so much. In a week, isn't it? Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. Take care. Bye, have a great day.